The pharynx is inside the glottis, which is right here. It goes into the pharynx. So the glottis is the opening? The glottis the is the opening. The pharynx is essentially the inside of the tube. And then rather than having an epiglottis, they have a laryngeal prominence, which is essentially the swelling. It's just like a muscularization of the glottis. No. Oral cavity, there's the glottis, and the, whatever the other thing is called, laryngeal prominence. I'll never remember. Yeah. <laughs> so what's, what exactly is the laryngeal prominence? It's just lets them close the glottis, rather than having like an epiglottis like mammal, mammals. Well, our laryngeal prominence is the uh, Adam's apple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> and then tongue, everyone. Get that. Vocal sac, this is a male. I think by vocal sac they just refer to like the pouch. This this can all swell up. I don't know if the female just lacks that flexibility. I, well, they don't actually have that flexible pouch. Yeah, yeah. They're this opening one, to it. They don't have those openings either. Did you find openings? No, we did not find openings. Oh, yeah, they're so small. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, that's good to know. There are openings that we missed. Um, marginal teeth run along the margin of the mouth. <laughs> And they're kind of like, they're kind of like a file. That's what they feel like. You can run your fingernail along them. This one actually has really prominent ones. You can actually like, actually like, hear me scraping against it. That's the tongue sticking out right here. Yeah, yeah, that's the tongue. That's okay. how they flip out their tongue to catch prey. The back of the tongue flips forward. Sweet. That's how most frogs and salamanders do it. Cool. Um, what, what's next? Oh, the palatine or vomerian teeth are these two nubs. This one has them too. They're like, they're like right here. On the top of the bottom. The top. Okay. They're these things. They're like two little nubs, right here and here, right next to the coanae. You call those the palatine teeth? No, no. Those are the. Oh yeah, yeah those are the palatine or vomerian teeth. They, they just have two of them. Where are the coanae? Coanae are. Oh, this frog is in a bad position. Coanae are these guys. Right next to the palatine teeth, or it's palatal teeth and vomerian teeth, coanae. And the astuchian tubes are way back. They're large. Yeah, you can see them. Yeah. And this one, they're right here. Or there. And then the tympanum. This is the actual like. I believe it's the actual membrane itself. Like, yeah, it's inside yeah. the membrane. And then, yeah, yeah. And then the stapes is actually this little guy underneath the tympanum. Oh. Yeah. Huh. Then, so you got the tympanum. Uh huh. And then the stapes is underneath it. It's this little bone. Just to my understanding, that's what it is. The, sure. pa the pericardial cavity is right here on this guy. And then this one's way easier to see. It's like down in here. You can actually see most of the separation. Not to the be a huge pain, but do you use a pointer instead of your finger? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. It's just hard to see with pericardial, your finger. Pericardial <laughs> cavity. And then on this one, it's right here. Yeah. Well, I'm thinking I'm going to study off this later. <laughs> yeah, yeah, true. And the pleuroperitoneal <laughs> cavity is just holds all the viscera. The larynx. I can't actually like really get to it underneath all this wonderful mass, but it's in there. <laughs> it's wonderful deep. Mass. Yeah. <laughs> lungs are nuts. Yeah, lungs. There. This one's easier to see, see the lungs. Yeah. This. They're this like oh, okay. odd deflated sac. There's one on each side. It's like dark red. <coughs> yeah, yeah. It's dark red. It's kind of <coughs> textured. This one's way smaller on the left side. I'm not sure if that's normal. It's not bad, is it? No, no, no. This is a female. Those are eggs. Oh, on the cool. female, I'm, we're assuming it's these things. This is the lung on one side. Okay. And this was the lung on the other side on the female. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're little. Yeah, they are quite little on that one. The esophagus. The esophagus is like food chamber, just down in here. You could technically get to the stomach. How is that different from the pharynx? Pharynx goes into the lung, pharynx. the airways. Okay. Yeah. Is the pharynx like a trachea? Yeah, they don't have a trachea, okay. which is even weirder. Mm. It okay. goes straight into their lungs from okay. the pharynx. Weird. Okay. Yeah. Sweet.
Yeah. And the esophagus you should be able to find back here underneath everything connected to the stomach. It should be like up here, technically. Okay. The esophagus. Connect to the stomach. You got your awesome duodenum. Which goes to the small intestine. Don't miss anything yet. No. The pancreas is way easier to see on this one. And then esophagus, stomach, and then duodenum. And then there's the pancreas. Is this like the pink one? This sliver thing right here. This thing. Yeah. That's, That's the pancreas. Pancreas. Yeah. In between, like, in the duodenum, essentially. The liver, these big lobes, pretty easy to find. Gallbladder. Gallbladder. And the male on this one, it looks like a raisin. On the female, it's dyed pink. Oh, okay. Where is that? It's usually pink yeah. raisin. Wait, can you point out one more time? Sorry. I can't. This pink body in the center oh, of the liver. Oh, okay. Thank you. And then on this one, it's this nasty raisin thing. <laughs> um, spleen. <laughs> oh, spleen's on this. Easier to see on this one. This is your spleen. Right here. That little round? Yeah, this little, like, raisin. Okay. Or looks like a bean almost. Yeah. <laughs> Kidney bean. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Here. Spleen. Ah. <laughs> and then large intestine on these guys is the last short section of it. Oh, yeah, on this one it's just right here. The, yeah, centered. The small <coughs> intestine pinches down really fast, too. How can you tell where the large intestine is starting? This pinch? The sphincter, technically, right here? Yeah, you can see in this one, you can see it, too. Oh, right, I get it. You can see where it shrinks down. Oh, this one's way better, actually. Small intestine to large. Oh. Yeah. They don't really need to absorb a lot of water since they're in water most of the time. Next, do you have the cloaca? Oh, cloaca, yeah. All the way back down here. This essential like, meeting place of the urinary. And, yeah, that whole area. Kidneys. Kidneys are on this guy are pretty. It's a deep along the spine. I'm not sure if it's this whole tissue sac area. I'm pretty sure it's this huge kidney bean thing. Whoa. Yeah. Kidney. It's on both sides, too. On a quiz, do we need to put... Just the nephew? Yeah, do we need to have the Can you turn that towards us, please? Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. I was trying to find it on the other side, but it might just be easier to... Michael, on a quiz, can we just say kidneys, or do we need to say upper That's the kidney. At this point, just say kidneys, but as we look at the urinary system near the end of the course, then Pepsi's on this one. Awesome. They look just like the spleen, <laughs> except for they're a lighter color. And there's one on each side. They're paired. They're also paired with the fat bodies, which is their fat storage system. So this is the fat body with all this stuff. Oh, yeah. It's just fat. And then the testes at the base of it. Well, what are these on this one? This is a female. Oh. So this, they're oviducts. I'm assuming an egg. Yeah, they're awesome. Testes? Ah, uh, yes, perfect. So that brown body right next to it, what was that again? This is the spleen. Thank you. Yeah. The fat body? The fat body is this wonderful stuff. Looks kind of like bacon. There's, there was a lot more of it. We removed a lot of it. So we could, like, deal with it. Yeah, there's stuff. Do the females have fat bodies, too? I would assume they are just associated with the oviducts, but when they make the oviducts, I'm assuming they burn up all the... That thing you just grabbed? Yeah, this is all oviduct That's tissue. All oviduct? It's all exploded, though. Sweet. Yeah. It's kind of upsetting. <laughs> Urinary bladder? Urinary Thank bladder. You. Sweet. <laughs> Urinary bladder is right here. It's this empty sac right at the base. Yeah. I guess technically you could see the cloaca all the way deep if you really wanted to. Does the lady frog have it too? Yeah, yeah. They both have a urinary bladder. This one's just way harder to see because okay. they have all of this this wonderful tissue, huh. eggs and overdip. Sweet. Uh -huh. Yep, that's it. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank no problem.